Welcome back to Newsmax Now. I'm Rick Blackwell. Another loss for Donald Trump after his comments about illegal Mexican immigrants. The FAA is now changing the names of three navigation waypoints used by pilots. All three had been named for Trump and are near Palm Beach International Airport in Florida. An FAA spokesperson says they try to use names that are non-controversial. General Motors is recalling some 780,000 crossover SUVs today. Carmaker says that problems with struts could cause the rear power lift gates to fall and hit people. So far, GM says they've received more than 50 reports of injuries. The bird flu that's devastated chicken and turkey flocks in parts of the country now hitting a summer treat. The water ice in custard chain Rita's says it can't get eggs to make its custard. For now, they have to replace it with soft serve ice cream. MTV set to air a documentary called White People later this month. It's put together by Jose Antonio Vargas. He's an illegal immigrant from the Philippines. He says he wants to explore ideas like white privilege, affirmative action, and racial identity. And the NFL is saying goodbye to quarterback Ken Stabler, best known as a Raider, helped lead the team to a victory in Super Bowl XI. Stabler died this week from complications resulting from colon cancer. He was 69 years old. 